Hey gamers, Smoking Tires here from CTVI Gaming. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create new tools and weapons, but also how to create higher quality tools and weapons. Okay, so let's get into it. Okay, so we're going to show you the tools first of all. So we're going to just look at um, the axe side of things. We won't look at shovel and so, such like because it's basically the same. But we'll just show you the progression. So what happens is initially when you start out, all you can create really is the stone axe. It's, all it needs is a few ingredients, some small stone, plant fibers and wood. Okay. Now, when you go to create it, what it's showing you is it's going to take one second to create a level one item. Okay. So we can click that and off it will go and there it is, it's created. Okay, but how do we upgrade it? How do we unlock the next step? Okay, well that is you have to invest in the skills needed to craft higher quality items. Similar, if you want to create the next level up, so from stone we want to go to iron or to steel or to the chainsaw, we have to spend the skill points or find the schematics. So if I want to, if I click on the iron fire axe, you can see here that it's locked. In order to unlock it, I need to invest skill points in minus 69 or I need to find the iron tool schematic. Now, also, the investing in minus 69 will also upgrade the ability to craft higher quality items. So at the moment you can also see I would only be able, even if I found these schematics, I could still only craft quality one items. So let's invest. We're going to go into skills, we're going to go under strength, we're going to go into minor 69er, and then we just highlight. So if we highlight the tool tipper here, you say the, see in the description it says everyone has to start somewhere. But if you invest in this, you will craft quality two tools. So let's spend that skill point. Okay. Now let's go back, let's go to the um, stone axe, now you can see we can craft quality tool, quality two um, level items. So let's go craft, and there we go, we've got a level two. We also see now, with the iron fire axe and the iron pickaxe, it's no longer locked here. These are now unlocked items, so I can go ahead and create both of those as well. And I will create quality 2 because that's where I'm at. Now these are much more complex items to create. So they take a little longer than a second. And you see here it takes 3 minutes and 24 seconds to create. Okay, we're going to cancel those. But that's how we do it. So if I want to continue to invest and get to quality level 3, I need to continue to invest into minor 69er. If we highlight Johnny Newcomb here, so here on the second line, it says craft quality free. Okay. Now you see it's locked. I can't spend here, and that's because it, the requirement is strength level two. We're only at strength level one, so we go to strength. Let's upgrade to two, then back to minor 69er, and then upgrade. Now we go back, we can create quality free level tools. Okay, so that's basically how it works, as simple as that. Um, now, to unlock the steel items, you must read the steel tool schematic in order to do that. Okay, so got the schematic here, if you use that item, you'll then be able to craft the tools okay and it'll change from being locked to like it is with the chainsaw here to now telling you that you've got to create it at a specific bench and this is the workbench so we can't actually if you highlight the steel axe here there's no craft buttons we can't craft it in our hands we have to go to the workbench we go to a workbench and then you can see that it comes up as an item okay and it takes two minutes 41 now we're still at level 3 in minor 69 now, so we'll be creating level 3 quality tool. Alright, now for the chainsaw and the auger, the only way to learn how to create these is you must have the schematics. So if I, you can see that it's locked at the moment, if I read that schematic, it then becomes unlocked, and I can now go ahead and craft that item. I don't have all the, all the items, so crafting's greyed out, but that's how it works. And just for auger as well, 
let's just proof that so we can see that it's locked. The only way to unlock it is with reading the schematic. You can see it's unlocked. I could then go through and create it. So that's your progression. Let's just go back to axe. So it goes from stone to iron to steel to the motor tools. Okay. Now let's go back into skills just briefly. Um, and if we unlock all of the strength and all of the minor 69er, the question you're going to ask is what quality can I invest in? And you're capped at max of level 5. Okay, so we can create that level 5 item. Now you're probably going to ask why, because I'm sure I've seen level 6, and you're right. But level 6 you cannot craft, you can only buy them from a trader, find them in inventory, or steal them from someone else. That's the only way you'll be able to find level 6 items. Okay, so it's impossible for a low level player to find a level 6 item because the traders and the loot that you're raiding when you're questing is kind of set to a scale as well. So you'll only start finding higher quality items as your game level progresses. Okay, so it's a way of ensuring you know, you're not finding high quality gear at the start. So any level 10 player that's got a level 6 tool has either stolen it, been given it, or has cheated. Okay. So that's it, that's tools. Okay, so let's take a quick pause and let's talk about guns. Okay, so let's talk about the weapons then. So we'll start with pistols. Um, but the principle is exactly the same as tools, and it's actually exactly the same regardless of what it is you're creating, whether it be a pistol, a machine gun, a spear, a baseball bat, it doesn't matter, it's all the same principle, right? I, off the bat, you can only create quality one um, level items, okay? You can see here, I'm going to create a pipe pistol, but I can only create a quality one item, okay, at the moment. And now it will take seven seconds, so it's not too long to wait. Now if I want to be able to create a higher quality tool, um, pipe pistol, then I need to invest in Gunslinger. Okay, and that's the skill tree for pistols. Um, I will also, as I unlock Gunslinger, it will give me the ability to create the pistol as well. Okay, so the next progression would be Magnum. But it's also the same, so we could create a wooden club, and then a baseball, and then a steel club. If we want to bash things, we can create you know, a stone um, sledgehammer and upgrade that in the same path. We can create a SMG and upgrade that, so we create a you know, pipe version of it, then the SMG, the AK-47, the M60, all done exactly the same way. Okay, by spending in skill points to create higher quality items in the appropriate tree to then spend um, to unlock it as well the next couple of levels up but also we will need to find schematics in the long run for the high-end stuff exactly the same as in tools so let's go to the skills and just have a look here so let's start at perception if we come to uh, dead eye here you see if we invest in pot shot, you can just see on line two there it says craft quality two rifles. Okay, so hunting rifles, sniper rifles. That will be implemented or affected by this skill tree. So the more we invest here, the higher quality we can make. Javelin master, that allows us to create spears of higher quality. We move over to strength, boomstick. This is for shotgun. Pummel peat is for... Um, the baseball bats, yeah, clubs effectively. Um, skull crusher, the sledgehammers. If we come across to fortitude, brawler is around creating things like knuckle dusters. Um, the machine gunner will allow us to create assault rifles and so on. So this is basically how we do it. We have to invest into these skill points. So we were going to talk, we're doing pistols in this instance, so we're going to go into gunslinger and invest in pea shooter. And now we will be able to create, you can see, quality 2 level pipe pistols. We've also unlocked the 9mm pistol as well. But you can see that that can only be created in the workbench. So if we go to the workbench and we go to pistol, now we can create the quality 2 Beretta. 
Okay, so it's as simple as that. That is how we go from upgrading um, to higher quality items and unlocking all of the path for all of your tools. So obviously I've mentioned we can only create one to five in tools. It's exactly the same for weapons. You can only create from one to five. All level six stuff must be purchased from a vendor, um, found in high end loot. So you're talking, you know, you need to get your game stage quite up before you can start unlocking it. Or um, you need to steal it from someone else. So I hope this tutorial has been useful. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye for now.